Hello soldiers, in this video we are going to solve Alma Betters module 3 that is Mathematics for Machine Learning Assignment 2 and the topic is Vector Algebra and the first problem is the vector V bar equals to 4 comma minus 2 comma 1 ends at the point P 7 comma minus 7 comma 2 at what point does the vector start so we have to find the point where vector v dash starts so i'm just assuming as it starts at o so i'm giving the points as x comma y comma z as you can see so vector means which has a magnitude as well as a direction right so vector v starts from <coughs> 0 and ends at p so that's why what i'm doing ox equals to px minus vector v dash x so we are having values for vector v dash right 4 comma minus 2 comma 1 so what we have to do we just have to subtract here 7 minus 4 so i got 3 in the similar manner i have to find o y and oz also so i got minus 5 1 so values of o are 3 comma minus 5 comma 1 so at o it starts and it reaches to p okay now we are going to solve problem 2 check if the position vector formed by r equals to cos theta comma sin theta is a unit vector assume 0 comma 0 as a origin so what we are going to do r bar equals to cos theta comma sin theta so magnitude to find the magnitude we just have to do this thing modulus of r modulus of r means under root i square plus j square here i is cos theta j is sin theta so cos square theta plus sin square theta equal to 1 as we learned from trigonometry so root 1 1 r bar is a unit vector as its magnitude equals to 1 problem 3 find a vector that points in the opposite direction as a bar equals to minus 3 comma minus 14 comma 2 with a magnitude of 32 find a vector that points in the opposite direction so we have to find that thing so first what we are going to do first we find unit vector in same direction so we have we are going to find the unit vector in the same direction to find the unit vector this is the formula a bar by mod a as we seen in this problem mod r equals to under root i square plus j square here also same thing so we are just doing that minus 3 whole square plus minus 14 whole square plus 2 square so if i solve this thing i got this minus 3 by root 209 comma minus 14 by root 209 comma 2 by root 209 so this is the value i got let's call the vector we have to find as b bar so in this opposite direction we are just assuming that vector as b bar so b cap equals to minus 1 into a bar a cap so in opposite direction right that's why we are multiplying with minus 1 and we are also multiplying with the magnitude that is 32 so vector means it, it has direction as well as magnitude right so the magnitude is already given in the question and the direction is opposite direction that's why we are multiplying with minus 1 so if we solve this thing we got 
these values so now we are moving to the problem 4 given that a bar dot b bar equals to 6 mod uh, a equals to 4.3 and the angle between a bar and b bar is pi by 6 determine if b bar is a unit vector or not so we have to find b bar is a unit vector or not so a bar dot b bar equals to 6 mod a equals to 4.3 here theta equals to pi by 6 so angle between a and b a bar dot b bar equals to this thing mod a into mod b cos theta so we have to substitute here theta cos theta when theta is pi by 6 so we got this value you can use uh, your can see okay if you didn't remember your trigonometric values here i am just putting mod a value 4.3 I don't know the mod b value i just kept like that now what we are going to find we are going to find the mod b value so if we solve this thing i got so cos 30 value is uh, root 3 by 2 yeah cos 30 that's why i just kept here and you can just solve this thing using your can see as i told you you can just put those all values you will get the you will get the result okay since the magnitude of b bar not equals to 1 it cannot be a unit vector that's our answer okay that's it for now meet you in next video till then bye bye don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel like share bye bye